Hello everyone and welcome to another StarCraft 2 livecast. I'm going to be playing and commentating live, this time on the European server. I've been attempting to get an account from Bronze up to Masters on Europe. <clears throat> and things are going okay. I'm 21 diamond. I'm still winning more than not, so I'm continuing to move up. I'm actually not 100% sure where they can do this, and I know Europe is slightly higher than North America. Not but just slightly. Wins. And I'm well into Masters, I, I feel anyway, so... If I'm top 1% in North America, I could probably make top 2% on Europe. That's, that's, my, that's my theory anyways. But I'm going to play and keep playing on Europe until my win rate balances to around 50%, in which case I know I've kind of peaked. Not enough minerals. <clears throat> not enough minerals. So I notice a lot of Terrans are one basing more now. I'm not sure if this is a metagame shift or what, not but minerals. any one base play works very well versus my, you know, proxy racks play, so I need to abandon the proxy racks fast if I don't see a command center down. Normally what I do is just go with what I have, stop my marine production, and expand myself. And that works okay, even if I get stomped, um, I, I'm still got some stuff behind, I'm still expanding behind it. But you definitely don't want to wait until you run into like three or four Hellions, and then, or more Marines than I have. Oh, whoops. Forgot to build the barracks. Oops, a daisy. What's going on? These barracks are going to finish right on the same time, looks like. SCB ready. SCB ready. Go ahead. Ah! You scared me! I don't need that depot up fast, anyways. What's going on? Huh? Yeah, yeah. This better be good. Bad news? Oh. Yes. I pulled the I pulled the SCV I was trying to hide. I did not mean to do that. By the number. Vespine guys are required for placement. Go, go, go! What's going on? Huh? Uh, I like, oh, feel like I'm floating a lot too, man. Ah, you scared me. No add on. Want a piece of me, boy? SCB ready. Gangway coming through. And no low ground expansion either. Been waiting on you. SCB ready. Go, go, go! That big job. This better be good. Overtime. Additional supply depots required. Ah, uh, supply caps. Oh, my marine count is so small <laughs> compared to what it should be. Additional supply depots required. I thought I sent you over already. SCB ready. In the rear with the gear. Yo. Uh huh. Big job, huh? Roger. 
Defense is under attack. SCV ready. There's no sign of a Complete. command center here. Oh, there's a command center, never mind. So I'll throw it on my own. SCV ready. Hmm, so that was one on one for a minute there. Base is under attack. SCV ready. Not enough minerals. Research complete. You floated by me, I didn't see. Oh. SCV ready. In the rear with the gear. SCV ready. Base is under attack. I don't think it's gonna get me. I don't think it's gonna get me. That open. No, oh, there that evens the drone count. Vespine gas. Dre 
Transformation is in the Insufficient Vespian gas. SCV ready. You gonna give me orders? SCV ready. I got my ears on. Confirmed. SCV ready. Mineral field depleted. SCV ready. Go, go, go! SCV ready. SCV ready. Yes, sir. Upgrade complete. SCV ready. SCV ready. Not enough minerals. Huh? SCV ready. Catch up on this drone count. Our SCV count is so far behind now. Is under attack. SCV ready. Armed and ready. Upgrade. SCV ready. Yeah, yeah. SCV ready. Right. Who called in the fleet? Research. Complete. SCV ready. SCV ready. All right, time for another What's going yeah, on? There we go. SCV ready. I feel like I got a Viking. There we go. SCV ready. Just the two star ports. Yep, yeah, that's fine for now. It's probably all, all I can afford. SCV ready. Not enough minerals. SCV ready. Not enough minerals. In the rear with the gear. SCV ready. Who called in the fleet? It's a saturation, a little oversaturated here. Depleted. SCV ready. SCV ready. That's fine. Fine. Done and done. SCV ready. Yes, Commander. Huh? Yo! SCV ready! Uh -huh. Yeah, add a couple more star parts now. SCV ready! Mayday! Mayday! Thors, okay. Thor Viking. Let's make sure we got your motto. Mineral field depleted. Ah, me. SCV ready. Who called in the fleet? Well. Depleted. So we have three, three upgrades. Oh. Get down to sensor tower. We hear you. In the rear. We go ahead. Upgrade. Add on. Complete. Additional supply depots required. Bad news. Mineral field depleted.
Additional supply FCB ready. Big job. SCB ready. There's a tower over here too. Yeah. A couple we more star ports. No, we're not going to be paying for upgrades as often. Bad news. Who called in the fleet? Ready to blunder. What's going on? In the rear. Ah! You scared me! Well, big job. What's going on? Who called in? Ready to blunder. Oh, I was gonna get my third upgrade. Vikings. I don't know. Let's go Ravens. Doing that. Stop. Go ahead. What's going on? Am I pressing the wrong button? Vespine Geyser exhausted. Research complete. Big job, huh? What's going on? Woohoo! SCV ready. Upgrade complete. Made for battle. Yes, sir. So I pulled too many SCBs there. <laughs> oh well. Don't have time to fix it now. Let's make sure the SCBs can't escape and then we'll start attacking. Yeah, I think this game's more or less over because I dominated that battle. Vespine Geyser exhausted. Go ahead. Ah, you scared me. Oh, 
So I don't need deep bows, maybe I'll make a missile turret, just so there's something more useful. Ah, you scared me! Who called in the fleet? I'm going! That was pretty good kiting with the Vikings. He, uh... Ah, sorry, I just need some water there. Uh, he was pulling back and making sure he focused fire the Ravens before they were able to launch their Seekers. Um, see if I can get there quickly. But I don't think any of those Seekers landed. Uh, let's see, highlights in this game. So one Rax, Reactor, Reactor Helene opening, straight into Command Center. So he didn't actually have any Marines, but two Hellions is enough to scare the hell out of me when I have my Marines. Of course the Bunker, which is nice. I thought I'd keep my eye on this, but I didn't see it pass. I wanted to land and block it. Oh, at least I'm kind of messing with his mining. This is where things went really well for me. Workers killed. Thirty-six over six income. Thirty-six over twelve. Looking good until. He returns the favor, killing off 23 of my workers, now it's 27 over 15. So I'm still in good shape, but could have been game over right there. But with a stronger economy, um, it's hard for him to abuse the 
early game disadvantage of the uh, bow cruisers. Like my army should be able to challenge his before I max, and I shouldn't. That should never happen. Just kind of poking around with this guy. Nine on his third. I'm taking my fourth around the time he's taking his third, though. So I'm just keeping my economic lead. There go his fourth. Here comes my fifth. I believe this will be the first major encounter. No, no, not for a while. So he decides to attack into this. It's back up to the start of the fight. Um, I didn't put too much thought into it besides spamming Yamato on Thor's. Hopefully I didn't do it overkill. Like four Yamatos on the same Thor or something stupid like that. Let's bring up the unit's last tab. I'm ahead by 2500. So the engagement starts now. Uh, at this point, my Raven, my Vikings are on attack move, so I want my Vikings to kill his Vikings and my Valkyries to kill his Thors. Um, he should want his Thors to kill my Vikings, so then it's just my Valkyrie's left over against his Vikings, which he can kite forever, like he did at the end. So pulling SCV is an auto repair. Always works out pretty well. Especially when he doesn't have anything that shoots at the ground. I mean, Thors can shoot at the ground, but they won't in this scenario. They'll go after the, uh, they are targets. And I went from 2,500 ahead to just over 11,000, right? Almost 12,000 ahead. So that, like, I destroyed like 9,000 more than him in that battle. Including, like, taking some hit points off my own planetary fortress, because I don't know how to queue up SCVs properly, apparently. And at this point, just take that lead. Uh, supply catch, you can see him well ahead there. Waste your motto on that missile turret. <laughs> Just extend that lead. He's going after SCV, it's not a big deal at this point in the game because I have so many command centers and can replace them quickly. So it's not the economic hit it normally is, it's just, you know, the cost of a, like, you know, he kills five SCVs, it's not really hurting my economy. Is just taking away 250 bucks because I have to replace that. I guess the whole point of this was actually see if any of those uh, seeker missiles hit, and I don't think they did. <laughs> oh, and I didn't have the duration, did I? Yeah, that would have made the difference right there. <laughs> this is so close to catching up to the Vikings. Secret missiles are slightly faster than the Vikings. So this is kind of annoying. I guess PDDs are kind of safer than Seekers, but when there's that many Ravens, it's just way too tempting to throw a Seeker missile down. Three Seekers can kill like 30 Vikings <laughs> if he doesn't micro it. Um, yeah, that was the end of his Viking count. And I had not, I didn't have a ton of production, but I had. Um, yeah, that's it. I had six star ports pumping six Vikings at a time. Alright, so with that, this is extended game is finally over, so thank you everyone, and goodbye! Check the description for a thumbs up link.